So now we've saved that, I'm gonna go ahead and again, do a save as, change this to example four. Now I wanna get into what is called lists. And there are a couple different kinds of lists, unordered list, ordered list, definition list. Um, we're gonna look at those here. You're gonna find that you use lists way more than you think you would once we get into CSS. Um, but at its base level, it is what it is. It's, it's like an unordered list is considered a bullet list. Um, an ordered list would be like a bullet list, only swap out the little circles or bullets for numbers uh, and so on. So this is the first, this is the first element that we're gonna work in that has um, more than one tag associated with it. To start an unordered list, we first use the UL tag. And this is going to wrap around what we call list items. So I'm going to hit enter a couple of times to give myself some space. Tab out. We're going to create a list item. And that is with the LI tag. So these are the two components needed for a list, or in this case, an unordered list and the text for our list needs to go into a list item. So let's go ahead and just for fun, I'm going to copy this up here and drag it down. And make this a heading level four. And we'll use this Unordered list to mention the two characters that are in the story. We have a dog, and that's going to be list item one. So we create another list item below that, and we have cat. Save that. Flip over to the browser. Go ahead and change our file name. There you go. So we've got a heading level four bullet list with dog and cat. Now let's go ahead and do the same thing only using an ordered list and I'm just going to continue to go down the line here with these headings. Now here's an example where I'm going to give myself some space here. I'm just going to hit enter a bunch here, move things up. Again, this doesn't really matter, and I can you know, remove these lines later. So we'll go ahead and do an OL tag, which stands for ordered list. We'll put a list item in there. Um, now it's important to note, the only thing um, code-wise that's different between these two tags is the first tag, the OL, instead of a UL. So what we could actually do is I could remove this and I could simply copy, I'm going to do control C and come down here on line 51 and control V for paste and that works the same. Now if we scroll up here though, that's not exactly true. The cat shows up first, the dog shows up second, so let's just change these out really quick. Save that. There you go. And you see our, our headings are starting to get actually smaller than our main text. So a lot of times you won't um, use heading tags that far down uh, in size unless using CSS to modify them.